Hi, I'm Shannon from houseimprovements.com and today I want to just uh, show you in this video a bit of a supplement to our installing a dishwasher video. Uh, we've had a few comments on uh, the fact that I didn't uh, show the electrical hookup. So I, I've got an opportunity here, we've got a dishwasher, it's actually not even in the, it's just sitting up on a bench here for demonstration, but I just want to show you the actual electrical hookup. So we'll just uh, come down below here to where it is. So you're going to find in most cases, most dishwashers, they're going to have some kind of a panel here just below the door, usually attached by a couple screws. So just remove that panel. It's usually two pieces. Now behind that panel, you'll find the electrical hookup, which is usually pretty marked with a warning sticker. Uh, it's usually over in the right hand corner here. So once you find that little door, it'll just be a screw holding it on there. So just take the door right off. Put it out of the way. And this is where you'll find the hookup. So what you should have is a dedicated run to the dishwasher, a 15 amp breaker, 14 two wire. Actually, in some places they will allow you to basically wire it up with a cord on it and you could have a plug in back in the, uh, you know, back against the wall under the cabinets where the dishwasher is. So depending on which way the wiring in this, like for what you have to do here is really the same, whether you have a cord or hardwired. So this one would be a hardwired example. So we've got 14 two coming in. Back here, you'll find that there's a hole in this box where the wire would come in. That hole doesn't have a clamp on it. I've never seen a dishwasher anyways where it comes with the clamp. So it's important not to just stick the wire loosely through the hole and leave it sitting there. Over time, it can vibrate, rub through, and maybe short out. And being that that's all uh, metal, it can short out or electrocute someone. So you need to install some type of a clamp uh, in the back of that hole made for wiring. This is just an example. There is one in there. Um, so it would come through the clamp, get snugged up, and then uh, the two wiring you'll find out of the dishwasher right here. This is part of the dishwasher. You'll have a black and a white wire. So those will be there. Then you would have your new, I'll just undo these quick. So once you stuck your household wire through, this is it here with the ground. The ground comes in, there'll be a ground screw and a clamp. Connect the ground from your supply wire right to that. Then uh, these are the wires that come existing on the dishwasher. So you're gonna wanna just take your, it's just simply white to white, black to black. And obviously you don't want your breaker to be on. So make sure your power is shut off. So white, I'm just using these morettes to attach it. And it's as simple as that. You don't need a whole lot of excess wire in there. You know, about five, six inches is all you really need sticking through the back of the box. And then just try to neatly uh, fold these back in there so that when you put the cover on, everything stays out of the way and doesn't get pinched anywhere and that the morettes are still tight. Okay, so then uh, all you'd simply do is put that cover back on, put the screw back on and uh, put the cake kick face back on. So it's, it's not really that difficult, but I guess we did forget to mention it in our other video. So now you know how to do it. Thanks for watching houseimprovements.com. Uh, you can check out our website. You can also check us out uh, on our YouTube channel where we have lots of different videos. Thanks for watching.